Another tool in a spline menu in an ad is a chamfer. We insert a rectangle that has a hard corner or you can insert a spline that has a hard corner. The chamfer uh, tool is to make grounding uh, <clears throat> in a hard corners. It's make the rounding chamfer them. So we have to make this parametric editable in a cinema. If you have to first select your spline that you want chamfer, if in a cinema 4D, if you select nothing, everything is selected. For example, here if I select nothing, anything in uh, it chamfer work for um, points, spline point. So the chamfer affect all those points. We can access the chamfer tool in a spline in a add or simply in a right click when we are in a point mode the chamfer tool is here first click and drag then do not anything don't click in a scene don't click anything just going its tool if you click it's been done or do anything for you just going directly to its radius and change your radius okay if you click again, as you can see, because of all those points are selected, it chamfered them again. Okay, so do not uh, touch anything or click anything directly. Go to your chamfer. Okay, going back, going back, and right click, chamfer, click and drag for adding uh, chamfer, and after that, going to the radius for changing your radius. Because of the real-time update, you can see the update here. You can uh, toggle between flat and chamfer tool and curve tool. And it's done. You can reset your values or it's done. For finishing the object, the escape or space does not work. Just go into the move tool. Going to the this spline, select if you want to select a special point. First, select them, right click, and simply click and drag to chamfer. Then, going to the radius and change that. Okay, for example, I need 15 and going to the move. Okay, if you insert a new object and make it editable, and for example, we want to select I want to chamfer that point select that point before right click go to chamfer <clears throat> if you want to uh, execute the previous setting don't you don't want to click and drag and setting simply click new transform in a new transform it acts it does for you that chamfer very easily you don't need to click and drag and change it go to the move tool for example you want to chamfer that right click chamfer you have a perverse setting new transform in add to new point so the new transform tool is for that purpose okay this is a chamfer it's very simple and straightforward hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release